giant Pacific octopuses are solitary creatures, so in order for mating to occur, they have to find each other first. Once they find each other, the male will actually embrace the female and insert a spermatophore into her oviduct with a specialized arm called his hectocotylus. Now this arm has a groove that runs down it, and at the end there are no suckers. He'll take a spermatophore from his siphon, run it down the groove in that third arm to the right, and into that hectocotylized end, and then place that hectocotylus into the female's oviduct to drop off the spermatophore. This will then be able to fertilize the eggs as they come out of the oviduct one at a time. When she lays the eggs, she lays them in clusters or strands. These clusters can have anywhere from 100 eggs to 500 eggs, depending on the density of the cluster. And she can have hundreds of clusters per clutch of eggs. So they can have anywhere from 15,000 to 80,000 eggs per batch, depending on the individual animal that is laying the batch of eggs.